What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. I know, I know it's been a while, but I decided that, you know what, I've had a lot going on and I will catch you guys up in a little bit, but I had to, if you saw by the title of this video, I had to talk about um, a really big thing that just happened. I dressed T.S. Madison for the MTV Video Music Awards. Um, and it was honestly a full circle moment. Um, one, because Maddie is um, someone that I look up to, uh, but she's also my big sis. And we met probably about eight years ago. Um, I want to say about eight years ago. And we, I like, I loved her instantly. And ever since I started Riley Knox Couture, I wanted to dress her. I was like, let me just make you something, you know? And she kept saying like, oh, you know, um, I need to lose weight or like I got to get remeasured or whatever. And I was like, just send me your measurements. I'll send you something, some stretch piece because I know she loves stretch pieces. And uh, she just happened to come to D.C. And I was like, well, when you come to D.C., let's hang out. Well, she ended up coming to D.C. We didn't end up hanging out. And I was like, I'm going to I'm going to fight you. I'm going to I'm going to beat you up because like you did not call me to hang out. And it just so happens that she got invited to the MTV Video Music Awards. And she was like, sis, I need your help. I didn't, I'm sorry I didn't get to hang out with you, but I need your help. I need a Riley piece. And the, here's a little bit of footage from that. <laughs> so I had to call my sister at the last minute. She said, bitch, give me. Very last minute. But give me a I Riley really piece. do it for you. Give me a Riley piece. I've been begging for your measurements for forever. She said, bitch. I got you. I said, what's your zeal? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> so while when Maddie called me, I um, immediately started sketching and I started sketching. I sent her the sketch over. I sent her the ideas for what I wanted to do and kind of like a mock up um, of the fabrics and all of that stuff. And um, I ended up going to her hotel the next night. And we end up sitting on the uh, bed just talking for like three hours. And then finally I measured her and I showed her what I was going to do. And it was fantastic. Um, I met her amazing hairstylist and makeup artist, Jameson. And it was just really good catching up with her because there's a kind of wisdom that you just can't get. Um, and not even the wisdom, just like a kind of conversation that I just cannot have with my um, heterosexual cisgender female friends or male friends, whether they be bisexual, gay, whatever. <laughs> um, it's just something about the trans experience. And I have these conversations with my friend Isis all the time. And I really enjoy having that conversation, these kinds of conversations with Maddie because she gives good advice, but also like with just something like a kindred spirit, like girl, like you understand, you know, it's just like when the girls, the girls get together, we have these conversations and it's just amazing. Um, so, um, I came back home and the next day went to the fabric store and prayed they had the fabric that I needed. They just so happened to have just the, enough fabric that I needed for Maddie's outfit. And Maddie has very specific me measurements. She's very voluptuous and very hourglassy in her voluptuousness. And so, yeah, I ended up um, getting the fabric and in about eight to nine hours, I made her this amazing dress with this corset underneath that this metal looking corset of course she's on beyonce's renaissance album cozy the song cozy and so we had to kind of go with that renaissance theme and so there was that uh she wanted to do silver and i was like let's do a little silver mix of silver and gold and um so i made it and uh she got me a ticket to dc and i got on the train So I got on the train to New York and um, she called me and she's like, I need you to style this whole thing. Like what kind of, you know, earrings am I going to wear? What kind of jewelry? Like, what are we going to do? And I said, you know what? I got you. You want me to style this from my days of walking around New York and going to the wholesale district for the supplies for my show? I'm like, I've got you. So I went to this store that had the most amazing accessories. And I mean, they have everything. It's a wholesale store. And I got her several options in silver and gold. And um, I did that. And when I got to her hotel, I was like, I got you options. <laughs> but uh, 
do you have a purse? And so I ended up getting her a silver purse too. She's like, no, I don't have one, but I ended up doing that. Um, and then just fitted it on her and did like any alterations that needed to be done. We need to take in a little bit. Um, as you see in the clip here, uh, you'll see her pinned in the back and it's still a little bit long. I was like, you gotta let me cut it. And she's like, I don't want to trip. And because she didn't want to slit. Um, so that's what you see right here. Ready? Sorry. <laughs> you, you gotta let me cut it's it. It's my wedding day. <laughs> Let's do it. It's my wedding day. <laughs> okay, there you go. Yes. Mm -hmm. What you think? I love it. Now the awesome thing is Maddie can sell a garment. Like, like she just knows how to give that femininity and that walk and just all of that. And so I, when I saw the fabric flow and it was just like liquid, it literally looks like liquid metal. And I could not have been happier. And then I got on a train, came back to DC, and I waited the next day for the VMAs. And I was like, oh, I can't wait to see what happens. And ah, uh, Jameson, Jameson, if you're watching this, I've already told you this, but you did that. The hair, the makeup, it's just something about, see the thing when you make something for someone, when you have the designer, yes, we as the designer do our thing, but then there's the hair and makeup team that puts it all together and then the styling of it all. Of course, this time I did all the styling, but it's really also about the way the person himself carries the garment. And when you feel good, you look good, when you look good, you feel good, and you're feeling it, you're gonna sell the garment. And she went on that red carpet, and all I kept getting were all these notifications from people, you know, new followers, and new, so if you're new here, hi. Um, and then also just people telling me how amazing they thought she looked, how the hair just looked amazing, she looked like a Renaissance Barbie, and just all of that. And so I'm really happy with the way that it came out, and I'm just, you know, it was a full circle moment considering like she is, um, on the Cozy album, I impersonate Beyonce. And also, she was going to the MTV Video Music Awards. I am the MTV Video Music Award. And so it just all just, you know, and then her being my girlfriend and just like, it's, you know, her um, sourcing for some from someone who, you know, putting a spotlight on someone who's transgender and also um, a designer. You know, you can never say that Maddie doesn't support because she's got flack before and she's, you know, she could never say that she doesn't support, you know, her own, whether it be black women, black trans women, like she employs everybody. So it's just amazing. And I just am looking forward to dressing her again. We will work together again. We've already talked about it. Here comes the hurricane. Here comes the hurricane, bitch. We got to get the rest of it in the car, but how do I get you a piece? Water. <laughs> We should have did it. But it just was an amazing moment and um, it's been very busy. I've had a lot going on and I will tell you in a future video, I promise you, I promise you, I will show you all the things that I've been working on and all the things that have been going on that I haven't caught up to you guys in a while. I think it's been several months. I know it's been several months, but I have some things coming up. I'm going to vlog those things, I promise. Uh, you will see those things. I'm not promising you when, but I'm going to try to be more regular with my schedule, okay? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much for watching. And uh, please click the like and subscribe. Um, and uh, you'll get notified when I have more videos. All right, bye.